How to fix NordVPN not connecting on Windows 10 slash 8 slash 7. There are several reasons why you may be having trouble connecting to NordVPN on your Windows computer. They include issues with your account status, network settings, adapters, or app configuration. That's why you should go through the following steps one by one. Note, after each step, check if the issue still remains. Part 1, check for any issues with your account, making sure there are no issues with your account, confirm that you are using the correct password for your NordVPN account. Go to nordvpn.com, open my account tab, and try logging in. If you forgot your password, you can retrieve it here. Note, if you are happy. trouble remembering your password, try using a password manager. To circumvent this issue in the future, we advise using a password manager. This way your passwords are secure and you do not have to worry about forgetting them. If you are looking for one, you can check their new product NordPass. 1.2 Make sure that your NordVPN account is active. Go to nordvpn.com, log into my account tab, and check the status of your account there. Alternatively, you can access your account panel on this page, https colon slash slash ucp.nordvpn.com slash dashboard part 2 if that does not help check if your nordvpn application is set up correctly adjusting the windows app configuration make these adjustments to check if your application is set up correctly try switching between tcp and udp click on the cog gear icon on the top right corner of the app click auto connect on the left side of the settings menu disable the choose a vpn protocol and server automatically option select the open vpn UDP, or OpenVPN, TCP, protocol. Try switching to another server, open all countries drop down in the app and select a specific server. Try resetting the application, open app settings. Select advanced. Click run diagnostics tool. In the opened window, select reset app. If you are getting fatal, blocking DNS failed error, reinstall the NordVPN tap drivers. Go to control panel at or remove programs locate NordVPN network tap and delete it. After that, Download and install the tap drivers from https colon slash slash downloads dot nordcdn dot com slash drivers slash windows slash one zero slash nordvpn tap slash nordvpn tap setup dot exe and try connecting again. If the connection issue persists, Try the following steps. 1. Go to Network and Sharing Center. 2. Go to Change Adapter Settings. 3. Right-click the tab Nord Windows Adapter and select Properties. 4. Select TCP slash IPv4 and click Properties. 5. Click on Advanced tab, uncheck Automatic and set Interface Metric to 1. Part 3. Make sure. The tap adapters are installed and running properly, tap driver error when connecting to a VPN. To make sure your issue is caused by the tap driver, you can check the connectivity logs from the NordVPN app, open the NordVPN app. Go to settings-show advanced settings-diagnostics-run diagnostics tool. 
Click on Collect Diagnostics and complete the process. Open the NordVPN app installation folder and find the Diagnostics folder. By default, it is located at C colon backslash program files, x86, backslash NordVPN backslash. You will see a .zip folder with the date of the diagnostics. Example, March 7, 2019 15 underscore 24 underscore 30 z logs .zip. Double click on the .zip folder and locate the service xxxxxxxx.nwl file. Example, service 2019-03-07.nwl. Double click on the .nwl file, open it with your favorite text editor, and check for the errors below. You may notice one of these error messages, fatal all tap windows adapters on this system are currently in use. Usually, restarting the tap adapter helps in this case. To restart it, follow these steps, 1. Go to Control Panel Dash Network and Sharing Center Dash Change Adapter Settings. 2. One of the local area connections will have an undernamed TapNord Windows Adapter V9. 3. Disable it and enable it again. Try to connect now. For error fatal there are no Tap Windows adapters on this system or fatal, blocking DNS failed. You should reinstall Tap drivers. You can download them here, Windows 7 users, https colon slash slash downloads dot nordcdn dot com slash drivers NordVPN tap slash NordVPN tap setup dot exe Windows 8 HTTPS colon slash slash downloads dot NordCDN dot com slash driver slash Windows slash 8 slash NordVPN tap slash NordVPN tap setup dot exe Windows 10 HTTPS colon slash slash downloads dot NordCDN dot com slash driver slash Windows slash 10 slash NordVPN tap slash NordVPN tap setup dot exe Part 4 The issue might lie in the configuration of your Windows OS, its applications, and networks Checking your operating system configuration. 1. Add exceptions for NordVPN.exe, NordService.exe and OpenService.exe to your firewall. If you are using the window
firewall, please add six rules to it. There should be three outbound rules, one for Nord.exe, one for Nord.service.exe, and one for OpenNord.exe. Three inbound rules, one for Nord.exe, one for Nord.service.exe, and one for OpenNord.exe. Here is a guide how to manage Windows firewall rules https colon slash slash www.digitalcitizen.life slash manage hyphen rules hyphen windows hyphen firewall hyphen advanced hyphen security if you have any other firewall software you should be able to find the rule option in the application settings 2. add exceptions for nordvpn.exe nordservice.exe and open nord.exe to your antivirus application you can usually find this option under the settings of the application 3. Check if you have all the latest Windows updates installed on your machine. Some security updates might be missing and causing the connection issues. 4. Change the configured DNS, go to Control Panel dash Network and Sharing Center dash Change Adapter Settings. One of the local area connections will have an undername tab Nord Windows Adapter V9. Right click on it and select Properties. In the list that appears, click on Internet Protocol Version 4 and Properties. Select Use the following DNS addresses and add NordVPN DNS addresses, 103.86 and 103.86.99.100 5 Flush your network stack, enter these commands into your administrator command prompt one by one, tutorial on how to launch a command prompt as an administrator. IP protocol configuration slash release IP protocol configuration slash flushes IP protocol configuration slash renew netshare winsock reset netshare interface IPv4 reset netshare interface IPv6 reset netshare winsock reset catalog netshare and IPv4 reset reset.log. Netshare and IPv6 reset reset.log. Afterwards, restart your computer.